Hey guys, welcome to my glam space. Today's video is going to be all about my hair. This unit is from my first wig and I'm going to be taking you guys along with me start to finish on how I apply my unit when I'm not getting done at the salon. I, so I had a video where I went to the salon and people were asking how long does your hair last? When do you have to touch it up? So I would say about a week that I can have my hair um, like that. And then I need to reapply my unit. I need to touch it up. Maybe the lace is lifting so this is what I do um, once my unit needs to be touched up I'll wash my unit and then I'll do all the steps that I did here so if you're interested to see how I installed my wig let's go so guys let's go over some rules first if you are my skin color or darker we will not use this wig cap it does not fit our skin color and yeah we shall use something else this is what the wig cap looks like you get them in your typical wigs but this beige color does not fit my skin color it's going to look really weird underneath my wig because it's not going to look like my scalp so i am going to put this on so you guys can see and this is with it on so the problem with this wig cap is that it actually has a band on it that would need to be cut out so this method that i'm going to show you is if you do have a wig cap that matches your skin color because you will be cutting this band off what you can use is stocking stocking that matches your skin color and that's what i'm using this is going to make our wig application flawless and seamless and the part look real so go out to walmart go out to target to your local rite aid and get the color that matches you so as you can see when i put cut some stocking off and put this on it matches a little bit better it's going to look a little bit more realistic all right, so this is my real hair. The next step you want to do is have your hair braided up. So in the next clip, you'll see my hair braided up, ready for my wig. Her name is Amanda, and she is a Malaysian beach wave. This is from my first wigs. This wig was already prepped as far as bleaching the knots and um, the hairline being tweezed. So if you want a video on that, you'll have to let me know. But this is me just prepping the stocking cap. Um, and getting ready for it to be put on my head. I'm gonna put it on my head. I accidentally was being retarded in this video. I could have just scooted my stocking cap back and cut the excess at the tip and not do this extra step. But like I said, if you have the stocking cap with the thick band around it, this is a method you'll use to get the thick band off. So I'm gonna be using Got To Be Glued, the yellow bottle. And what I'm gonna be doing is I'm going to be putting this around the perimeter of my hairline so that when it dries, I'll be to cut away the excess stocking cap that's on my forehead. Yeah, we at the spot, they be stunning now. They don't see the bigger picture we be cutting now. All I'm saying is the man that I'm becoming, he gonna take the Now you are gonna need your blow dryer because you're going to be blow drying this glue so it can dry faster. Now a step that I use that I just wanted to try out was using the got to be glue free spray just to give extra hold on the cap not coming up so I put this on and I just continue to blow dry this area you want it to be completely dry so when you cut it away it doesn't lift off you want it to be on your head and dry okay so get your blow dryer back out this is gonna take like maybe like 20 30 minutes to dry like I said did I need to use so much would it be faster maybe <laughs> so after that I'm going to use my scissors and I'm going to cut away the uh, cap on my forehead so like I said this is the technique for if you're using a wig cap and having that thick band so this is what you do if you have the wig cap now if you have the stocking cap don't be like me just scoot it back on your forehead and just put a little glue at the edges okay y'all understand now this is what I should have done just put a little bit of got to be glue on the edges so it doesn't roll up but like I said I don't know what I was thinking so this is what you guys will do with the stocking cap now after this is dry this is what it looks like and I'm gonna put on my unit and look the unit is on but it's already looking like my natural scalp so I'm going to take some clips and I'm gonna pin um, the hair back on my head and what I'm going to do is I'm going to put another layer of got to be glued and I'm not going to let this dry completely like I want it to be tacky but I don't want it to dry completely because I want to put my lace on it so this is me with the glue not too much just enough and I'm going to spread a thin line so I'm going to spread this out and make it a little bit thinner 
gonna take my blow dryer but you want it to get start getting a little clear but it, you don't want it to be clear you don't want it to be white but then you don't want it to be clear so that's what I'm doing putting it on my hairline and this cap is actually at the tip of my hairline so um, only on the edges is the glue or the gel actually getting kind of on my hair but it is a, a gel a gel glue so it's not actually a hard glue like literally if water gets on it or if I'm in the shower and I wash my face and water it's gonna come up it's not harsh on your hair so this is me lightly putting my lace front on the got to be nicely pressing it down and I will use whatever around me to like press it in I have nails so that's what I'm doing like with my nails pressing in I think I picked up a comb to help press in make it just really blend in really well and then I'm going to take my blow dryer and I'm going to blow dry this I want this to be completely dry the next step is to create some baby hairs and this is actually the part that I'm not the greatest at so I'm taking um, a toothbrush and I'm trying to create some baby hairs going on and this takes forever because I'm not the bestest at it but just keep working at it keep you know trying until you get your baby hairs how you like it if you even want baby hairs this is optional some people don't like baby hairs um, my hairline's kind of thin so I feel like I don't know they look good on me so that's what I'm doing so now my baby hairs are done or possibly I was just over it and what I'm gonna do to lay my baby hairs down even more is I'm going to put on this scarf this is like one of the shorter ones and I'm gonna wrap it around um, my perimeter now this is when I'm going to style my hair you want to always put the scarf around your baby hairs and then flat on curl or do any of that to your hair so this is how I would style my units on my head I did want to show you guys a little more about the unit that I'm wearing in this video so this is how the unit looks just washed no product on it in the curl pattern all the information will be in the description box and this is one side straight in the other side just brushed out I really really like this unit and how you can wear it curly and then you can wear it straight this is me after I styled the unit and just taking off the scarf and yeah this I really like this unit then I went back to another clip before I decided to flat on my hair and me just putting it up in this half up half down thing and how basically the hairline isn't going anywhere because it is dry okay and this will last for five days to a week and then I'll do it over again. Um, so I don't have one of those like roller sticks for flyaways so I'm going to improvise with some edge control just like a little bit in my hands or I could do um, like a hairspray but I'm, I'm going to do the, the edge control just going to roll it in my hands and literally go over the flyaways ha 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 that did it so guys i'm finished installing my unit what do you guys think i think i did a great job for this to be like my second time doing this but if you guys have any other methods or any better ways to do it just uh, let me know down there in the comments because we need everybody needs to know how to slay this method i think it's bomb i love wearing wig units now they're like my fave recently so you guys will see more units from me what do you guys think about the curly i want one even like curlier like i love this wave like this is like a, a loose curl um i would definitely want like a, a kinky curly hmm maybe that's my next look but i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys